This is an oasis, a place to escape for a few minutes or even for a few hours. It's the Bosky Art Center, located in the minds of many people in the middle of nowhere, Clifton, Texas. Joanne Spieler came up with the idea of creating the facility and bounced it off of longtime friend and Western art collector, Joyce Jones. Uh, Joanne was a visionary, and I told her, I said, that's the squirreliest idea I've ever heard. Where in the world did you think you were going to put a center for the arts in Clifton, Texas? Especially when the idea included putting it in the administration building of the old Clifton College that later became a machine shop. But after some work, the Bosque Conservatory for the Fine Arts was open for business. And I guess like the movie, if you build it, they will come. They did. Slowly, but surely, when we did the expansion four years ago, we doubled our membership. An expansion program that took a lot of faith. And when we did the building campaign, they said, you'll never raise $3 million. It can't be done. Yes, it could be done, and it was, allowing the conservatory to build more exhibit space in the main building and connect the tin building theater to the rest of the facility with a lobby walkway and cafe reception area, creating what we now know, not as the conservatory, but the Bosky Art Center. The Bosque Conservatory of Fine Art, to me, was a little grandiose from day one. It did not convey what I would like to say to everyone who enters. This is for all the arts, for all ages, for anybody that is interested in the visual arts, the performing arts, we're open to you. And with that in mind, the center is ready to expand again. Right on the other far side there, there is enough room for a three-story building. There will be 10,000 square feet on each floor. We'll have an extra elevator. There will be bathrooms on each floor. The first floor will have meeting and conference space. The second floor will be the Jones Gallery. My husband and I are leaving our entire art collection to the Bosque Art Center. And we have to have a place to house it. The third floor will have even more classroom space. And in the old building, the auditorium, which took up the entire third floor, will get a facelift. We can have uh, book reviews up there, small concerts up there, uh, just all kinds of things. Uh, there again, we don't have to work around the 10 building theater and what they're doing. But you don't have to wait until that project is done to see all that makes up the wonder we call the Bosky Art Center located in a town that is a wonder in itself. I just think that the art center and the museum and the Lutheran home and the hospital are all such jewels in the crown that is Clifton. A crown that sparkles even more thanks to the artists who live here. Bruce Green gave a presentation and he said per capita he thinks there's more artists here than there are in Santa Fe. The Bosque Art Center is here for you, open Monday through Friday from 10 to 5 and Saturday from 10 to 2. To learn about our painting, photography, pottery, sculpting, culinary and literary arts programs, tin building theater productions and much, much more, go to bosqueeartcenter.org. If one child in 10 years ends up with a career in the arts because of the art center, and as far as I'm concerned, we've done our job.